Shalom everyone, I hope that you are doing well. I'm just jumping in here to do a general reading. If you are returning, welcome back guys. And if you're new, my name is Shannon and I'm glad to have you. Uh, listen, my channel can be uh, very intense. So we look at a lot of criminal activity most of the time. And so buckle up, um, it's, it's, it's real talk here, okay? We uh, attack the occult and people who do just wicked, stupid nastiness and we don't hold back. We look at end time prophecy. I keep the Ten Commandments because I do have a Hebraic descent, but my channel is not churchy or religious or anything like that. It could come across that way because I, I love the scripture. It's found in the tarot and uh, it's honored here. And so I love you, Holy Elohim, maker of heaven and earth. People call him the universe and he is. He's everything. He is Yeshua, which is salvation in Hebrew. He teaches how to get up and war and fight against wickedness and uh, not be uh, timid or afraid or shy to get up and just roar right back in the, in the midst of the stupid uh, stuff in our earth um, and I, I just love him he's everything to me and so he is honored on my channel so if you don't like scripture or anything like that um, then I guess I won't be your channel like I said I just love the truth and every one of us has to weigh out the truth on the inside and check out our motives and things like that so my channel um, that's kind of what my channel is all about so if you stay you stay if you don't then thanks for checking me out like I said so happy birthday happy anniversary as well anybody who has a special day I hope it's fantastic for you if you're down and out I get it and I send you love and light with all that said guys let's get started and see what comes out for this reading all right guys I think I'm going to take a rune for the overall energy for this reading let's just get connected here you hope I just invite your presence here I just thank you so much for Yeshua uh, the Hamashiach that walked among us in the flesh, um, your only begotten son. I just thank you, uh, Jehovah, that you sent saviors into the earth and that uh, he bled for us so that we get victory. And now it's time to fight uh, for uprightness and to uh, take this war for uprightness so people can walk in a blessing. Uh, what do you want to bring out here today, Jehovah? What's, what's the message? Thank you. We have the cup coming out here. This is the dice box. You could be dealing with somebody who likes to, you know, uh, to go and, you know, um, gamble or something like that. Um, don't have to. Maybe a cup is actually prevalent in drinking something as well. It's the letter P coming out here. This is diplomacy. Um, it's the ability to take a control over some type of a situation that's went down. And this is a protection assured within some matter. It's also precious intuition when it comes out and some type of stroke of genius or a winning from a gambling is what it represents. Um, so, uh, the letter P could be prevalent, person, place, or a thing, first, middle, or last name, or street name, town name, whatever it is for you, or the cup itself, or something like, again, something about drinking could be here, somebody won some type of winnings, that's great, something went down around that, somebody had to get some type of control over a situation to have some type of protection, whatever's went down around this cup, then we're going to see what's going on here. <clears throat> If you are new, I feel the energy, and sometimes, and I had it on another video that I did earlier, I really, I had a moment <laughs> that uh, I, I didn't know how to express myself. Sometimes it's just the energy flow, okay? So if I have kind of like a flighty moment, it's just that I'm experiencing a bunch of energy, and I am experiencing it today. Yesterday was a real heavy energy on me, but I just have to process it and things like that. Okay, so there is a victory here within some matter and big time travel with the chariot and with the eight of wands if something happened. You know, obviously the chariot is a warring implement in the um, Hebraic language. It's the letter Z. It's the Zion. It is like a, a sword type of an energy. So we have a victory over some type of uh, situations went down around this dice box um, or deal or the cup somebody's uh, you know winning something here somebody's crop has gotten cut this is a crop cutter um, somebody's food okay again drinking something eating something is here uh, this is about balancing okay somebody trying to get their balance pull down their mind having self um, confidence within something where they're going what's being communicated about an ordeal this is what's coming out here with a Z and the P zip somebody zipping away or something like that okay we have somebody who's got defeated 
in some type of ordeal. Okay, well, we've got protection. This is also a protection card. We've got some type of protection assured around something that's that needs to be, you know, taken control of. Okay, somebody went traveling. They did something. They were told to zip it up and whatever's happened here. Um, I guess that's what's showing. What, what is what is this about, people? Though? What do you bring out about it? There's stubbornness here. That five of swords is a I don't care, I don't care, I don't care kind of card. Somebody's been in rebellion within some matter. Especially somebody said you can't speak, you can't, you can't talk. You can zip something up, um, or somebody zipped away real quick. Cupid's arrow is on some type of a situation. We have a mother and a, and a um, husband energy that could be found here with the chariot. There's something about somebody's vehicle is also here. If somebody knew something happened on a trip with a vehicle and they were told to zip up something with an information because somebody's, you know, having to take some type of a control over a situation for protection's sake, then that energy is here. The hermit, <clears throat> this is somebody going within and analyzing something. The hermit knows something. This could be a judge or somebody who is a disguise around a situation as well. This is a snake in the basket, okay? And this is um, somebody trying to catch somebody up and storm down the clay. Again, be quiet. Go within. This is quiet energy coming out here. The letter T is here. Uh, death issues. <clears throat> somebody got some type of victory over some type of a death issue or a third party situation, okay? resting after a broken heart again you know i feel like somebody premeditated something that was coming out in my other reading today somebody did this is this is i'm going within i'm thinking something how can i do something I'm analyzing i'm calculating something up here and oh i got a stroke of genius here and something real quick is with the eight of wands you know if there's been an investigation around something because the eight of wands can be an investigation card then that's here um, this is the law as well. But if somebody's filthy and dirty inside of some situation, that's what's showing. Somebody's, somebody's, you know, died here. This is a death card as well. The strength at the bottom of the deck, needing courage. This is walls and ladders. And I will say that a reading that I did earlier, there was something about something inside an inner chamber of some sort, okay? We had a judge that came out, and the hermit can also represent a judge. Also, a physician could be here, a tax collector and stuff like that as well. Older person, being lonely, being segregated, kind of stuff like that with the hermit as well. But <clears throat> the chet in the Hebrew would go back to some type of a wall that Jehovah was bringing out in wording, or some type of a ladder, or something behind um, some type of an ordeal within a chamber, a parlor was there. This is children as well with this house. Uh, could go back to love and romantic things as well. So again, you know, Cupid's arrows have been here. And something happened in the Hebrew. This can also go uh, to meaning um, new births or passing through the portal, going from one space to the next. Also, some type of protection from outside things with the chet being here in this reading. All right, well, I'm going to take from another little deck here and see what this hermit's all about. Because, again, we have zip, like be quiet, but we have communication, so somebody's around the ordeal because we had third parties for some of you all in a disguise within some matter. And so this is about being quiet. There's also, <clears throat> if something secret took place with somebody who was under the knife, and we have a doctor here, and something secret took place with somebody being under the knife, that energy is here as well, whatever that is. Some, there's there's an investigation here around something like that. It's showing it. It's clear showing it. Show me this uh, hermit, please. <clears throat> somebody gave somebody something to drink. They passed out. They did something. They went somewhere. Somebody died over the ordeal. And somebody been hiding something behind some type of a wall. That energy is here in this reading. Or something about the matter. <clears throat> Show me the hermit, please. Yeah. 
well, we had third parties collaborating, like I said. We got more than one person here. We have the strife card here. There's a bunch of people here, okay? We have the, there's the chariot again coming out. Um, third parties trading something, okay? Well, wow. the eight of wands then would be here again. And again, another seven of wands. Something very passionate here. There's been a war because there is the, um, emperor an older person is here in this reading this is prison or somebody turned upside down or backwards organization or psychedelic stuff let's go back to poisons so if that cup has something to do with the poison or to knock somebody out within some matter they were they drove somewhere did something there's some type of a warring energy here um the emperor is the letter d but that represents a door so again, something behind closed doors, something behind some type of a gate or a wall. We got people uh, attacking somebody here, but there, there's like a wall here as well. Whatever all this is, there's psychedelic behaviors here with the hangman. Okay, somebody's been trying to figure out what to do. We do it. So there's the five of swords again. There's some type of victory here. Somebody's been over, uh, overturned or defeated within some matter. Show me the uh, four of swords, please. <clears throat> we have boss figure here. We have a business here with the hermit. Some type of business is here. Well, there's the lower version of the um, emperor, the king of wands. Okay, we have third parties here. All right. And then there's been a pregnancy, or there's the Empress as well. Um, the King of Pentacles is here, business. But these go back to business. And so if, if this is a surgeon, or if this is somebody just in your business, or your ex is here, then the Queen of Wands is here, or that's law. Um, the Empress can go back to law as well, legal matters, rich and generous. We have somebody won some type of money, or there's a contract here, or a baby. Uh, they're sacrificing as well. Some type of sacrificial thing is here as well. We have literally three people here on this um, resting after a broken heart with the three knives up over this person who's resting on the truth or some type of premeditation was here because we've got collaboration, okay? Something got sliced, okay? Again, this is a warring implement, but it is like a slicing. Something got cut within some matter, and it's here twice. We got it, So more than one person went somewhere in different vehicles around some situation because there's a, been an attack on somebody then some some type of a war has been here something got cut or sliced or something like that okay what whatever whatever that is and wherever it was okay we have a child or some type of a message with the page of pentacles here as well the eight of cups that's also a travel card but that's also it goes back to the eighth house of secrets and somebody invested in something um, I guess they did. They walked on to go get their ninth cup, the extra cup here. Somebody got some type of uh, victory within a matter, whatever all this is, <clears throat> for you. We have a perfect match here with the emperor and the empress. And so we also have exes here and the other man here. Okay, again, there was for some of you all, somebody cheated somewhere because it, it, it came out in wording yesterday. The whole of you just picked in my hand. The boss is here. Yeah, yes it is. There's business here. We also have a butler or a maid involved in some ordeal. And the other man and the other woman is here. Well, it is here in this reading. Scornful men bring a city, a whole city, into a snare. Well, we got a bunch of people down here in some type of freakishness. Okay? Scornful. Secretive. Zipping something up trying to get some type of whatever I'm, I'm trying to catch you up in some type of stupid net and they brought some type of a snare into a city okay uh, or some group did within some matter and we got somebody died over here okay but wise men will turn away that wrath are you wise I don't know something's happened somebody got some type of victory so if you're gonna turn it away that's wise of you this is a wisdom card as well uh, all who call upon Jehovah shall be saved Jehovah is Yeshua which is salvation thank you Jehovah they will go to prison again so they will somebody gonna go to prison for something that's happened somebody died Okay, some stupidness is out here. They're caught. Okay, well, thank you, you hold up. They're caught. They're caught. <clears throat> Give me just a second.
Thank you. There's a prison. This is also a prison card as well. So we do have the law here. Again, a judge is here. And we got little children and sacrificing, murdering going on, and psychedelic behaviors, and things around money, fortune, and cheating, and everything else. And it's caused nothing but a freakish war. We have the gentleman here. This this can be somebody's partner is here. Okay, we got a lot of people involved in something. This also can go back to, to a young representing a younger person. Okay, connected with this gentleman card as well. Again, we have, we've got child sacrifice and types of stupidness out here. Somebody was paid off to go do something around a contract. I guess it's here. So I'm very physical is around it. Um, this is a very masculine person, and the emperor is very masculine type of energy. The king of wands is real masculine. Okay, so the gentleman card is here. <clears throat> What else should I bring out here? The other gentleman card is we got a lot of people here. We got scornful people here. We have the stars, somebody's known. The emperor and the empress would represent somebody in the public eye. The king of wands is somebody also known within some matter as well. The dog is here. That's about protection. Somebody's friend or partner is here involved in something uh, or, an, or the dog itself is prevalent within a matter that's gone down. And somebody's a cheater. We have the other man, the other woman here. Okay, started some stupidness, then some ordeal, <clears throat> and there's children involved in it. The journal, this goes back to some, some type of a mystery that's been here, something that was written down, or some type of hidden thing has been here uh, within history itself. Somebody's been educated, there's a record here, you're doing somebody who's got a record, because we have, you know, the law is here, maybe they've already been in the pen, I don't know. Um, but we have a discovery. At the bottom of the deck, we have the house. Okay. The house is your residence. This is domestic affairs and family. So we had somebody's cousin specifically that's come out in two readings, two separate readings in the last two days um, that's been involved uh, because we got family stuff here. Okay, somebody's family is here. We have inheritances, so money and stuff like that. Somebody just took a gamble on something, thought they were going to do something stupid, filthy, and dirty. They started a freaking riot somewhere within family matters. Yeah, there's the five of like there's a lot of warring going on here. The five of wands, there's a lot of strife here. But there's a victory, it's showing a victory. The moon, the mother, the children. Okay, well, something deceptive has been here in this reading. All right, people, I just want to check the um check the energy and apparently there's a victory here. A toy train is also here and cutting off something in haste and urgent. Listen. We got children involved. And uh it ain't all right. It's just ain't all right, man. It ain't, shouldn't sacrifice. It ain't, it ain't all right. Um, we have some type of a horde of energy out here. What we do, we have the other man, the other woman. Something went down with somebody's butler or their maid or some stupidness with the boss and everybody else that's involved. I guess it's here. Um, we have the word Zoom is here. Well, we again, we have Zip. But we have travel energies coming out. This goes back, this Z and this M together is the chariot with the death card, okay? And it represents to plot something. Well, somebody did plot something. Somebody plotted some stupid, crazy, nasty, freakish thing, and they're going to go to prison because Jehovah says they're caught and getting away with it. There's mischief. There's heinous crimes here. Somebody invented something. The Empress also represents inventions. There's lewdness and perverseness to something that has been wicked around something sexual and perverse. Okay? Let's listen, people. Something ha happened, and somebody plotted some stupid, nasty, freakish, gross ordeal. And a bunch of people got up in here and what? Did some lewd, nasty, freakish, sexual thing to a person. Those people need to go straight down to the freaking pit of hell. And then they probably sacrifice the person afterwards because this is gross what's coming out in this reading. Okay? So these are the types of people we want out of the earth. Okay? We've had children around something. So somebody did do some type of a poison around children or just anybody in general and did some type of gangbang stupidness. These people need to be done the same exact way. Let them feel it.